Hello friends. In this lecture, we will be learning how to import data from Word document, TXT file and PDF. In the previous lecture, we have already learned two different methods. In this lecture, we will be learning one new method via which we can import data set from Word document, TXT file and PDF. We have also learned that why we need these data set. That means we need this data set. We have to import this data set from Word document, TXT file and PDF if we want to do the text mining. That means if we want to do the systematic literature review, we need the help of text mining or we want to extract the data from social media websites maybe your Twitter, maybe from Facebook or you want to extract the data from some news or from your want to extract the data from Google. So in that case you will be requiring to do the analysis in the form of text analytics or text mining. So for that you will be requiring to import the data set from either from Word document or from TXT file or from PDF. So let's learn one of the method that how we are going to import the data set. So for this method, we will be requiring the package read text. So you have to install the package. You should go to the tools, install package and you have to write read text, read text. And then you have to install it. Once you have installed it, you have to put in a library so library read text and then enter. Now I have put my package into the R. Now we have to use the command. So before using the command, I am going to store my data in X variable. You can choose any variable, maybe X, Y, Z or you can choose any name. It will not affect your analysis. So I am going to choose the name X. So in the X, I'll write read text, read text and in the bracket, I'll give the command file dot choose that I want to choose the file via which I am going, I, I want to extract the data. Now you can choose the TXT file, you can choose the Word document or you can choose the PDF. So let's say so I can choose any file. So first of all, let me choose one of the file from the desktop. Now I am choosing the file how to create hyperlink within the document. So this is a word file. So I'll select this and then I'll open it. Now you will see that over here the variable X is created. And now I want to see what this X is saying. So for that you have to write X and then you have to press dollar sign. Once you are going to press dollar sign, you will see two parts. One is saying doc underscore ID and second is saying text. So I want to import the text. I want to see the text. So I'll click on this and then enter. Now once I click on this, you can see that my complete data which is there in the word doc is imported. Now let's check. Now this is my word file, how to create hyperlink within the document and says the price of gold is a most controversial topic. Now you can see over here. Now how to create hyperlink within the document, the price of gold is a most controversial topic and it is ending uh, Indian general of economic and business or you can say some issues of economic development and macroeconomic policies. So that means it has extracted the complete data which is there in a Word document. Now let's see how we are going to import the data from TXT file. Now this is my TXT file and TXT file that uh, the word that is written over here is what is finance and it is ending over there People can save and their money will be safe. So let's see how to import this txt file. So again I will be using the same command. 
read text file dot choose. Now in the previous I have saved the command or I have saved the data in x variable. So I am giving another name over here. I am giving the name as y. So I want to save the data in y variable. So again you have to write the command read text then choose file dot choose and then enter. Now again I have to choose a file. Now I will be choosing the text file. My text file is with the name finance1. Now my data is stored in y variable. Now let's see the data. Just press y and then dollar sign and then you have to press text and then enter. Now you can see that complete txt file is imported. So it's starting from what is finance and then it is ending that their money will be safe. And you can see the file, your money will be safe. So till now we have learned how to import the data from Word document and from txt file. Now in the next video, we are going to learn how to import data set from the PDF file. Thank you.